Uh, this is my first time playing Poppy Playtime. But I've never really seen a full playthrough, so I don't really know exactly what to expect. So... Chapter 1, a tight squeeze. As an ex-employee of Playtime Co., you finally return to the factory many years after everyone within disappeared. Oh. You are about to see the most incredible doll ever invented. Her name is Poppy, and she is the first truly intelligent doll in the world. A little girl can talk to her. Poppy gives her answers. She is the first doll actually able to have a conversation with a child. Creepy. Hard okay. to believe. Just watch. <laughs> as lovable as a real girl and she talks like one too hi my name is poppy i love you can you help me polish my shoes why of course poppy just like a real girl poppy always wants to look her best perfect thank you <laughs> her hair is sturdy and won't come out when you brush it and smells just like a poppy flower is there anything else you'd like to say poppy i'm a real girl just like you. What's the time? Playtime! And if you've ever wanted to see how all of the nation's favorite toys that were kinda... created, Playtime Co. is now offering factory tours at just $2.99 a person. An entire hour in the most magical toy factory on Earth. What are you waiting for? Come visit the factory. For that price, you can get, like, a stick of gum. And that's it. <laughs> Nowadays. Now it's like 60 bucks a person, or even like a hundred. Oh, that's creepy. Well, not creepy, it's disturbing. Oh look, it's a poppy. It's a flower. Poppy playtime. The, the, the looks of the title always looks like he's supposed to have like 3D glasses on. Okay. Let's see, pause. Uh, controls, settings, I'm looking for mouse speed. That's a lot better. Okay, shift, sprint, Get open door. Ages, three and up. Hey, nowadays we have ages like... <laughs> um... <laughs> okay. Um, looks like Black Friday. I'm just gonna leave it to it. Can I pick anything up? What, what, what can I do? Poppy wants to play. Those eyes are too big for you. Those are huge eyes. Let's see to interact. No, okay. Take jump. I feel like I shouldn't be over here. Tab. Wait. Tab and escape are the same thing. <laughs> Item. Okay. Uh, I can't do anything on. Okay, I guess I can't do anything. Hi, my name is Leif Pierre, and I'm the head of innovation here at the Playtime Co. Toy Factory. If you're seeing this, then you're trespassing. Yeah, we play this little tape on loop whenever we close the factory for the day. So, trespasser, just to make you aware, while we pride ourselves primarily on our high-quality toys and excellent child care, we also pride ourselves on our security. For example, this facility is full of hidden motion triggers, which, once set off, We'll turn on the factory's emergency alarms and directly contact the authorities. And that's one of the more tame aspects of our security system. No spoilers. So, you've got my warning. It's not too late to turn around. I just hope that you're certain whatever you're doing is worth it. He sounds like Cave Johnson from the Portal series. Be healthy like Braun.
I feel like this train's important, but I don't know. Is it the code? Oh. Uh, is it green? I just saw a green color. Oh, it's green. Okay, well, I got it, right? Um, delete all footage. I wasn't here. I wasn't, I wasn't here. <laughs> Wait, what happened to the other chairs? I didn't do that. <laughs> um... Um, I want... There's a blue chair. The grab pack. Tighten the straps. Hold both hand cannons. Everything is canon in this game, even your hands. Only fire at small objects slash handles. Do not fire at co-workers. <laughs> Wires conducted. Thanks for rewiring. Oh, cool. And thank you. Make sure, even though you want to kill Susan, don't use Susan. Don't, don't, um, don't. I'm like, walk. I am in the glass. Well. Can I take the chair with me? <sighs> okay, we're taking the chair with me. Come on. <laughs> Come on. You know you want to. High five. I get jump scared if I just like do this. Okay. Oh. Hey Huggy, just so you know, um, I'm trying to do you a favor. Oh, pfft. where did the lid go? And he's gone. Uh, where's the chair? Um. Up here. Hey, what's that thing? Uh, is there anything up here? Nope, just. <laughs> Alright. Can I close this? Okay, bye, Huggy. Alrighty, so now I have my sister with me. Find whatever this is. Red, I found blue just right there. 
uh, yellow and green thing. Remember to take breaks. <laughs> breaks are quick. Um. Oh, there's the yellow one. You know, you know, like those, um, like those sticky hand things that like people put on walls. It reminds me, of, like, the hand reminds me of that. Just like. Also, everything has physics in a way. Oh, here's another one. Um, I have two things now. I don't even know what the batteries. I don't know. Uh, power thingies. Um, now I'm missing one more. It looks like I should open. I should be able to open this, but I can't. Just have some the box. Oh yeah, see, like, this just like, sh sh am I like gigantic? <laughs> I'm just. I'm like, <laughs> these are supposed to be like heavy in a way, kind of. Um, how about of that? The circle in the middle is I'm get, that thing there oh. is like um. Oh, I was a little bit of a little. Um, is like, um, how long I have for reach and whatever. I think. Yeah. I can open this. Why are you I can open this. Like it's slowly budging. I just don't know how I can fully open it. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> physics. <laughs> it works so well. <laughs> well then. <laughs> All right. Uh, oh, this is where I was before. Can I open this one? <laughs> I thought you sprayed something. Oh. I just, I just heard. Pss. Just me. <laughs> <laughs> it's cute though. I don't know why I find that funny. Just like. I don't know. It's going. <laughs> you just eat it. You palm it and then. Why did you do that? Where did that work? Um, so well, supposedly there's like an orange tape or whatever um, for the. Oh, here it is. Found it. Now I'm looking for the. Um, for the. I can't get out. <laughs> now, I'm look like now I'm looking for the. I, I, I don't know, let me see what I have actually. Okay, so. Oh, hi, Huggy. Huh? Um, okay, I have blue, yellow, green. Where's the red one? That wasn't the orange one. No, the orange thing was. Um, dump. Uh, the orange thing was um, this. Oh, creepy looking thing. Kind of reminds me of Disney. Rich, where are they keeping the Huggy boxes? I don't know. I couldn't tell you. Remember when maintenance left in a sweep of this place? <laughs> no. Exactly. <laughs> Nobody in this stupid company knows what they're doing. Oh, I swear, I haven't seen a single box in its place since they started flooding the storehouse with orphanage junk. Right. I get it. It's a nice program and a lot brand. 
just hard to be happy about it with manufacturing on our necks about it, because we can't buy stupid hockey boxes! Rich. Huggy box, I don't even know. Uh, what? You're what? Right. <laughs> you're right. We can't buy diapers for the orphans. For the orphans. <laughs> that makes me no sense. It does, but not that in this game. Must be more <laughs> Unfortunately, not in this case. A bit of a bit of a it's a bibble. <laughs> so what is that even? I don't know, I said clock. Ooh, that clock. <laughs> um, so... No, that's the clock, Chris. Oh, right there, the clock. That's where it is. Right here. Good job. It looks like yeah, that one. <laughs> Glad you could be your excuse. I'm so smart. I don't do hard. I bring. I bring. I bring. Yep, so we have one infinity gauntlet, and now we have two, wait. Now we have two infinity gauntlets. We're now back after the short break of the system crashing. What auto saved? I don't even know. Being in the dark. Okay, yeah. Um, we were here. Oh. More panic buttons. Those aren't panic buttons. Um, guess what's missing? Me. Well, besides that. Guess what's missing? Power? No. Poppy? Yeah, she's somewhere. Um. Guess what's missing? Oh, your hand! Yeah. <laughs> I have. <laughs> so, um, um. Welcome to Poppy Playtime. Um. Corporate re version. <laughs> So, this is what the game looks like when the game doesn't load. <laughs> We're gonna have to start anew. My, you weren't too far away, were you? We. Yeah, corporate version. Also, Summer here is Huggy. Like, down below Summer here is Huggy, I thought. Maybe not. That okay. one in the sky? Uh, no, that's something else. I don't even know. Um, title okay. screen. So now we're back to kind of where we were, um, kind with of. whatever this All thing, whatever this, <laughs> it's gone, <laughs> oh, there it is, um, reminds me of something and I can't figure out what it is, I know, um, so, now we figured out how to open, um, containers, uh, yeah, remember, hold it, not, yeah, 
So, okay, where was the other one? The one's up here. Grab that one. One was on the shelf somewhere. watching this later on being like it's right there you passed it 15 minutes ago five steps and three hours ago oh, so yeah. <laughs> <laughs> where is it was it in the box i don't know that like, i accidentally there it is, there it is. <laughs> Okay, I take and this. And the gauntlet. I go like that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like that. <laughs> So we just have this image here, uh, holding stuff until things get sorted out. Ooh, that's, that's a so small tiny. image. <laughs> <laughs> he looks pretty. <laughs> He's like, don't I look pretty? And you're like, no, hug the door. <laughs> Huggy wuggy went hug to hug the door. <laughs> oh, go wow, hug that, door. that's more demonic than I wanted it to. That's what I'm going to say now. Go hug a door. <laughs> <laughs> do, 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 Dora. Okay. Okay, we have our hands. We go. And those things work. Unlike last time, I could just walk them, walk up them. Okay. Same with that thing. Okay. Okay, so we're actually getting somewhere. Okay. Okay. Found the power. We're doing are it. we moving? We're or moving. are we walking? No, it's the conveyor belt. We're moving. Oh, well, that's not creepy at all. We're moving. Well, we just restored power here, so. Ah! Hi. I love being dumb trainers. Stuck on what you call it. Okay. Oh. Here's the next part of the game. <laughs> After three, no, two failed attempts. And. Oh, I, I, this is why I make a friend. For the first time. I can do that too. In 1960. It's that old. Make Our founder. Our <laughs> <laughs> rest in peace. Was a visionary. Good thing he wasn't a missionary. Elliot Ludwig was a visionary. Ludwig! George. Lude. No, it's Fred. Lude. Ginger! But Beethoven. Bach! <laughs> what about my Bach? <laughs> <laughs> Our founder, Elliot, Elliot, Elliot Ludwig, was a visionary. <laughs> he set the stage for <laughs> all of my time. Company's greatest feats. Yet all of the amazing things he created. The Make a Friend Machine is one of the most creative, impressive, and advanced. It is solely responsible for nearly every Playtime company toy sold on the market to this day. All it needs is for you to move your hand. <laughs> <laughs> All it needs is to be fed the proper parts, and it will then paint, assemble, and do a quality inspection of the toy. All, oh, please stop moving them. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> on its own. 
Gone is the need for complex sorting or ba back breaking la breaking back labor. Buck buck breaking. <laughs> Dance break <laughs> labor. <laughs> this machine can do all that and more. I don't know. Let's go. Oh, jump. We missed. Ugh. Did we break? It's a good thing we don't have feet. <laughs> One of them would be crickets. But if not, all of them. Uh, not. Wow, we are so smart. Let's go! It's it's good. Wait. <laughs> well, say goodbye to your hopes and dreams and the platform. <laughs> okay. Uh, but, oh, wait, no, that's not fun. Okay. So, watch this, like, just like. Whoa! Straight through me. Yeah, that's not how it works. <laughs> <laughs> On the opposite side, you, uh... Okay, so now we do... That, that, and then... <laughs> Use the forks. Um, Where did it go? Oh. It's the one side. Oh, okay. Do it this way. Do that. <laughs> Do that. My... <laughs> I'm being held on by it. <laughs> Eat. <laughs> um. I I just, so like, it's useful for, uh, go this way, go, a very, uh, this way, not this way. We're gonna somehow get all the way over here, that side. So we go this way, too. We're standing on it. I know, but last time I did that. You weren't standing on it. I wasn't doing this, either. I was standing right there, and I could do it. Okay, so do that. I feel like it has something to do with me. Wait, I do it this way. Supposed? Oh wait, am I supposed?
cat be? <laughs> we now have a cat bee in our inventory. Do we? Oh, there it is. Found it. Just had to turn up my brightness. Default. Go on. Oh, I like the brightness up. <laughs> So, Stella, what made you want to work at the Playtime Co. Factory? Playing with toys when I was young was so magical. I could go straight from my bedroom floor to anywhere in the world. It was such a great feeling. And being able to work at a toy factory, somewhere that can provide kids with that same experience, that's a pretty great feeling too. Sometimes though, I really, really wish I could go back. To being a kid, I mean. And it's weird, because adults are just kids, but older. I don't think anyone ever really feels like an adult. But your body just gets older and older. Oh. Human bodies just can't stay young forever. There's things though, like some trees that can stay alive even while being way older than a person. I mean, the oldest people to ever live are still younger than those. So I guess everyone is always young relative to something. Right? Alright, I think we're getting a little off track. Bye. <laughs> 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 oh, I got stuck.
Okay. <laughs> well then. <laughs> that mic's gotta pop. <laughs> Chapter one for ya. I actually didn't think I'd get it to play it through. Um, yeah. 